just showing here how uh, the Vive Connect AED, uh, when available in the community here in Cumberland County, will be utilized. Um, so the device actually is connected into the 911 center here. So when a call comes into 911, and they suspect that it could be a cardiac arrest emergency, they can actually press a button that will activate all of our these devices that are nearby that location. And so this red alert on any nearby AEDs would show up, and if someone were to accept the alert, let's say it's in your car, or in your home, or at a restaurant, and you happen to hear the alert go off, what you would do is you'd then accept the alert and you'd have a Google Maps taking you from your current location to the location of the patient. 911 can actually see the AED moving towards the patient. They can then track how you're using the device and help you use it in real time. And that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to show you actually, once you arrive at the patient using this map, how you would use the device to save a person's life. The device is actually going to provide you with audio and visual instructions uh, and so I'm not going to talk you through it instead we're going to let the device talk and explain to us how you would actually save a life all right powered on training mode if this is an emergency remove the training cartridge and install the pad cartridge if the patient is under eight years old you must press the child button on the top of the device once the patient's chest is exposed, peel open the package you pulled from the device and take out the pads inside. So these are the electrode pads right here that you would then place. Look the at the picture on the red pad. Peel off the red pad from the white liner and firmly stick on the patient's bare skin, exactly as shown. <laughs> Peel off the blue pad from the white liner and firmly stick on the patient's bare skin, exactly as shown. Patient detected. Do not touch the patient or pads. Analyzing heart rhythm. Shock is advised. Move away from the patient now. Stand back. Delivering shock in 3, 2, 1. Shock delivered. It is now safe to touch the patient. Let's begin CPR. Stack both of your hands on the center of the patient's chest. You would follow these instructions until EMS arrives on scene, at which point they'd assume care and start using their own equipment. But this device will keep telling you how to perform CPR uh, and then also keep your arms straight. It'll then reanalyze the patient's heart rhythm and, if needed, deliver another shock. And we'll keep doing that until EMS arrives on scene and assumes care. That's it, folks. One Anyone can use to save a life.